These 10 YouTubers passed away too soon. R.I.P. Hello lovely YouTube family, welcome back to 10 Focus. In today's video we're going to talk about these 10 YouTubers who passed away too soon. Before we start, I would want you to hit that red subscribe button so you never miss out on any of our videos. Ah, YouTube. How many hours have we spent lost to your depths, easily click sending us deeper into the internet's rabbit holes? Countless, probably, especially since YouTube stars make close to $20 million per year. According to Forbes, the top 10 YouTubers of 2018 earn an aggregate $180.5 million. That's a lot of clicks. But how do YouTube stars make so much money? Why do we love their content so much that brands pay them literal millions to sell us stuff? The connection. Social media like Twitter, Instagram, and all the rest make us feel connected to people we've seen on our screens, as if they were our friends in real life. This is especially true of YouTubers. These internet stars give an in-depth looks to their daily lives. They often show viewers their bathrooms for goodness sake. From skincare routines to intimate details about their creative processes, all in high definition. Simply put, the biggest YouTube stars feel like they're our friends. So just like when a friend dies, the death of a YouTuber is immensely painful. These famous stars were friends of the million of viewers and were sadly lost far too soon. Here it's in YouTubers who died far too soon. That's what makes the loss of a YouTuber so hard, especially when their death was unexpected or tragic, and unfortunately, more than a few of our favorite YouTubers have died since the launch of the video streaming platform. Take a look back at some of the YouTube stars we lost too soon. Number 10, Etika, real name Desmond Omofa. The 29-year-old who is known for hosting live streams and creating videos covering video games was found dead on June 2019 after being reported missing. Before his disappearance, he posted a concerning video titled, I'm sorry, that had his fans very worried. I shouldn't have pushed so many people away, now I got nobody. Etika said before his death, You know, I wasn't suicidal before, I really wasn't, but one thing I didn't realize is that the walls are closing in on me fast. I really had no intention of killing myself, but I would always push it too far. I guess I am mentally ill. Number 9. Cory LaBerry Cory LaBerry was killed in a drunk driving accident on May 10th in LA. The YouTuber was celebrating his 25th birthday with Ink Master star Daniel Silva when the duo crashed the McLaren sports car they were driving. Following the accident, Daniel, who was behind the wheel, was charged with murder. At the time of his death, Corey was a member of the C4 house alongside fellow YouTubers JC Kalen and Crawford Collins, and had over 339,000 subscribers on his popular YouTube page. Number 8. Grant Thompson The king of random, Grant Thompson has had over 11 million subscribers on his YouTube page when he was killed in a paragliding clash in southern Utah this past July. It is with great sadness to inform everyone that Grant Thompson passed away last night. Grant had love and appreciation for his fans, a statement for his page read at the time of his death. Please do a random act of love or kindness today in honor of the King of Random. Grant's legacy will live on the channel and global community he created. Number 7. Emily Hartridge Popular YouTuber Emily Hartridge passed away in July 2019 following a tragic scooter accident. Her channel was known for videos on relationships, loves, and her personal life, and her boyfriend Jake Hazel was known to make an appearance or two. Number 6. Bianca Devins Not technically a YouTuber, Bianca Devins, who is a very popular influencer on Instagram, was murdered by a fellow online gamer in July of 2019. The murderer proceeded to post photos of her dead body on Instagram before he was arrested. Number 5. Stevie Ryan In 2017, YouTuber Stevie Ryan, known for her channel Little Loca, was pronounced dead after an apparent suicide. She was 33. Her ex-boyfriend, actor Drake Bell, tweeted at the time of her death, Please wake me from this nightmare, my heart is crushed. Number 4. Christina Grimmie before finding fame on The Voice. Christina was gaining popularity on YouTube where she had 4 million subs at the time of her death in 2016. Christina was shot in a murder-suicide by an obsessed fan while signing autographs in Orlando. Her voice coach, Adam Levine, spoke out following her death, writing, Christina was a natural, a gift of talent that comes along so rarely. She was taken from us too soon. This is yet another senseless act of extreme violence. I am left stunned and confused on how things can conceivably continue to happen on our world. Christina was 22. Number 3. Greg Plitt The fitness model who had a very popular YouTube page was killed in 2015 after being struck by a train while filming a video at the age of 37. According to reports, Greg did not have a permit to film in the restricted area in LA. Number 2. Sebastian Baz Morris Though Baz didn't have a YouTube presence on his own, he was a staple on Lauren Ramiki's aka Lori DIY's channel in her early vlogging days. He dated the craft Afshiendo from 2010 to 2015, and she would often post videos about their relationship. After they broke up, Lori DIY said that they remained friends. Lori DIY realized that Baz had drowned on May 27, 2020 after he had a seizure while swimming. She explained that Baz had suffered from epilepsy, but that it never held him back from doing the things he loved. Number 1. Kobe Nunez Kobe Nunez, who is known as It's Kobe on YouTube, passed away after being involved in a road accident on August 17, 2020. He was rushed to the hospital in critical condition and underwent brain surgery, but unfortunately, the YouTube star succumbed to injuries. He was only 19. That's all for today. I hope you liked the video. If you didn't, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel so you never miss any amazing video from us.